New Smyrna Beach. Okay, we're getting ready to depart New Smyrna. Been down here for a couple of hours. I always drive down, look around. I'm still staying up in the Day Ormond Beach area, right next to Daytona Beach. There's my faithful horse tied up. It's always ready to go. It loves rolling down the highway. Had a delicious halibut fish dinner here. One of the best restaurants in New Smyrna. Papa's Drive-In. It was delicious. $11.71 for a huge piece of fish. Huge order of fries, all a diet drink I could hold, and a coleslaw. What a bargain. Yuckadee. Driving north down A1A through Daytona Beach, right through the middle of Daytona Beach. Show you what's going on here. where NASCAR was invented, right there at that hotel. The old steam liner. So another typical night in Daytona Beach. Now we're going up to Ormond Beach where my little room is. It's nothing fancy, but it's clean. It's uh, a beautiful night other than clouds. Beautiful night here, Daytona. I had some delicious fish. I can't pronounce it all, but Something like that. It was a special tonight at Papa's restaurant that I ate at. Oh, here's a new Hard Rock Hotel. Fancy smancy. They rehabbed the old hotel and spruced it up. Now it's called the Hard Rock Hotel. According to my temperature grades, the temperature in the area right now is 78 degrees at uh, 7.45 p.m. Speed limit all the way up through here from Ormond Beach, Daytona Beach, Point Sandlot, 35 mile an hour, and it's fast enough. It's only a couple of miles long, so it doesn't take that far. It's much more relaxing. Every now and then you'll see an idiot go flying by you. For the most part, everybody goes to the speed limit. And there is a heavy law enforcement presence down here, which I'm glad of. So I come down here to relax, drive around, film a little bit, not to get in a race with some dumb buddy. You know what I'm saying, Vern? Yuckety. Bel Air Plaza Shopping Center. Here's the La Playa Hotel, which is under the remodeling it, so it's all closed down right now. Here's the Denny's. If you got four or five hours to waste, that's a good place to eat because it is the world's slowest service for Denny's. You go in there after you freshly shaved in the mornings. Time you get your breakfast, you need to shave again. That's how slow the service is. And you can't do nothing that day because most of the day's over. Just exaggerating, but it's so. I'll take I hop or. Waffle House, even over that. They, they used to be great, but they're just not anymore. Denny's. I'm sure there's still some great ones out there, but that's not one of them. All kinds of beer joints, restaurants, clubs, 
uh, things of that nature sprinkled all over the Daytona Ormond Beach area. My little hotel I'm staying at is right here. Poor people welcome it, sad. So, right at home there. Pizza place up here. I got a pizza last night. Took it back to my room and ate it. And then about 30 minutes later puked it all up. I don't know what he put on it. You know, it tasted good when I was eating it, but here it is, the little pizza hut here. I don't know what the tan tans, extra sauce they put on it or whatever, but I, I puked like a show mule. It's awful, Your Honor. It's starting to get a little dark. I got the top down, as you can see. I'm gonna turn this, my horse around, take it back to the stable area. Take it saddle and bridle off, let it get a good night's sleep because tomorrow we're shipping out. We're going over to uh, Miami, see George Norrie, coast to coast Saturday night. We're either going to do that or we're going up 95 north with a homodon. Up through the Carolinas, over the Smoky Mountains, and back home. Sign off for right now. Yuckety.